The fiscal cliff, what is it and how can it affect your retirement? To answer these questions is my guest, John Kelly of Kelly Financial Services in Hickory Hills, Illinois. John, welcome back. Thanks for having me, Scott. I guess we should start by defining the fiscal cliff. What exactly is it? Fiscal cliff is basically a term used to describe, describe the dilemma that Congress is having today because they didn't pass the budget last year and it's going to expire at the end of 2012. When that happens, uh, taxes are going to increase because they didn't, pass, they didn't get the $1.2 trillion in cuts they proposed over the next 10 years. So with all those numbers in mind, John, um, how would retirement income be affected? It's going to have a big effect on it, especially in capital gains, income taxes and capital gains. The uh, capital gains tax is going to go from 15% to 20%, and for higher income earners, it's going to go up to almost 24%, which is drastically going to affect their income tax. John, can you talk about Medicare? How could Medicare be affected here? Well, Medicare is going to get a cut by 2%, so a lot of these extra costs are going to come out of retirees' own pockets. Um, especially with the Obamacare, uh, that, that's the reason that the 24% is going to come out of the higher income earners. Well, part of the fiscal cliff is also estate taxes. Can you talk about wealth transfer? This is going to be a big one. Currently, assets right now over $5 million are taxed at 35%. It's going to go up to 55% if, we, if the fiscal cliff ha happens, uh, any for assets over a million dollars. So for wealth transfers for children in the future, they're going to get substantially less from what they were planning on getting. Well, John, I'm going to have to say, none of this sounds very good. What should people do? Well, right now, especially with the wealth transfer going to be a big one, they should, everybody's uh, situations are different. Look at vehicles that we can transfer assets more effectively. Right now, what we do for a lot of our clients with big IRAs is convert them to Roth IRAs. So they will get them tax-free. They'll pay a lower tax rate right now in 2012. And then the assets will become tax-free to their children and the beneficiaries in the future. Also, look for we use a lot of life insurance planning for a great way of offsetting the estate tax for people in the future. John, if someone watching this would like to get in touch with you, how would they do that? They can call our office at 708-576-8999 or go to our website, kellyfinancialservicesinc.com. All right, John, appreciate your time. Thank you. Thanks, Scott. Thanks for having me. My guest has been John Kelly with Kelly Financial Services in Hickory Hills, Illinois, and you're watching Annuity News Now.